bought this lash lift kit and this wax pot that I'm going to be trying. So I'm not going to try the lash lift because obviously my eyes are done. My makeup's done. This is going to wait till tomorrow when I'm looking like a bum. And, but we're going to try this tonight. I've always been afraid of like, first of all, hard wax, um, scares the shit out of me, but also just like doing it on my own at home. I've already decided that my, um, armpits are too sensitive. If I'm feeling, I don't know, if I'm feeling adventurous tomorrow, I will try to do just like, a, I'll try a pit. <laughs> Oh, no but right now my legs are looking crazy but my legs have like stubble they're not super hairy because I did shave them recently but I really want to try this um, wax thing so I, I think if the rule is that they are as long as a grain of rice because that's usually the rule for the kitty the little meow meow um, if that's still the rule for the legs then I think I got a grain of rice in most spots so we about to get into this um if i can get the box open so this is my first time opening the box so it came with some beads came with some sticks more beads, more beads, and I think they have, oh, they have different, like, reasons, so this says best for chest and back, which I'll probably never use, because I don't need my chest and back, um, this says best for face and eyebrows, I might use that, because, listen, like this chin, and this stash, I probably use it. And this is best for face and eyebrows. So it's two of those. This one says best for chest and back. So I don't know which one is best for legs. I target both thick and thin hair is what the yellow one says. And target thin fine hair is what the face and eyebrow says. So I'm going to go with yellow because I feel like I have kind of coarse hair on my legs. But that's everything that it comes with. And it has a little manual. A manual for how to use it. And the actual wax one. really hope I like this because I hate buying stuff that I kind of have no use for or that I use like once and be done with it. Um, so it has like this inner thing that you can just kind of like lift up and take out. Put it down in there. This is the cord so you need like a three prong because I know like I was using an extension cord and I think I need to actually plug it into the wall, but it has a lid. I am an instruction manual girl, so I'm going to read. Get yourself ready with some type of floor covering. Right temp to wax skin is between 150 and 180, therefore please allow time for the wax to cool down after the wax is fully melted the 24 hour patch test okay so my first time turning it on they definitely said i don't know what that was Okay, they said put it at a temperature between 150 and I think 175 or 170 something. 
trying to find the book. Oh. 150 and 180. Okay, so I'm assuming when this gets to the temperature that I set it at, then it'll be ready. I'm only going to use a little bit of beads because I only have a little bit of hair. And this is the one that targets both thick and thin hair. It says it's for chest and back. Um, there wasn't anything specific to legs. Like I said, I really don't have a ton of hair. Wait, why is it so high? I only set it at 150. And it has surpassed. Came with all different types of sticks. I might use it on my eyebrows eventually. This is definitely, it's already at 202. What is happening? But I don't know what to do. Okay. We're going to try. It is too hot. No. I'm about to tear myself up. I think I waited too long for it to cool off. This is... Ow, not going to work out. Oh, I can already feel it. Oh, God. Wow, it really did get, like, some of the hairs. You can see a little bit. So, I got to work on my application. I just burnt the fuck out of myself. Shit. It's way too hot. And I turned it down. To like one of the lowest fucking settings. I mean, it, it. this also got a little bit of hair. So for transparency sake, I am... Um, for transparency sake, I am adding more beads. I think my thing is just figuring out how to pick it up. If I can't, if I can't figure out how to like pick it up before I apply it, that's gonna be my biggest. Um, Pet I'm gonna have to watch some more videos because I really don't know how to get it from like this watery consistency without like burning myself. These are my strips so far. You can see a little bit of hair up here, a little bit of hair here. Okay, I hope it's not too hot. I feel like it is. I'm scared. It's very hot. Very, very hot. Okay, this might be one of the better ones. Ah! Let 
You definitely can't underestimate the goddamn temperature. Okay, okay. We see some follicles. You guys, so the temperature is coming down now that I set it to like the lowest setting as you can see. And so I think it won't take as long. We're here. You definitely gotta do a, a quick pull. I feel like if you're slow, it's gonna make it more painful. That didn't get as much, but that was a cleanup strip. Good one. I got a good feeling. I got a great uh, feeling about this one. It was kind of a good one. That was a success to me in my eyes. Okay, y'all. I feel like the pressure is get, getting shit. The pressure is getting lesser. Um, so right now it's at 169, which is like an ideal temp. But we only one leg in. I'm certainly running out. So I know next time to use more. But I think this was just the comfortability test. Okay, you guys so here's the results this is the finished leg this is a not finished leg so as you can see lots of hair and this one is practically bald not even practically this one is bald she's bald she's bald and she's torturing people who have hair uh i didn't really get up here around the knee so you can kind of still see follicles, but I think it looks good, especially for a first try. So as you guys can see, I showed you kind of the wins, the fails, the everything of me trying this wax pot for the very first time. Um, I will insert after pictures of just like, well, I didn't take before pictures, <laughs> but I will show you like how smooth it turns out. Um, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Um, we will be back for the lash lift. Thanks. See you next time. hurts like a bitch shit Look at, 
Oh my God. Do you see all that hair? It's so long too. This is hell. Oh. Oh. Shit. Oh my God. I am deceased. It feels smooth as shit. But was it worth the torture? Mm. I'm a little bit irritated. I'm a little bit irritated. <laughs> 